this is Mike here. Uh, by request, I'm going to do a uh, easy video lesson on playing some blues rhythm guitar. I'm just going to show you some basic blues rhythms. Um, uh, we'll do it in the key of A, and uh, I'll try to do it simple for you so you can understand it. And uh, it's really fun once you get it, just for jamming. Being able to play a good blues rhythm is fun and being able to jam over a good blues rhythm is fun and you can get together with people and jam and have a really good time on acoustics or electrics uh, but blues is a great way to uh, just jam and express yourself with feeling with your instrument and um, just a great great style of music and like I said before and so many others have said it's like the foundation of most rock but anyway I'm going to show you blues rhythm and uh, we're going to do it in the key of A I'll play it real slow for you. Well, I'll play it normal and then slow so you can see and hear it. time for you. I'm going to turn the treble up a little bit, give it a little bit of a crisper tone on the Les Paul, playing in the neck position. And uh, one more time, here we go. This is in the key of A, just a standard blues rhythm. That's the rhythm. Let me get up close and show it to you. My reverb's going a little nutty there. Okay, so we're going to do this in A. And you start off on the A bar chord. Basically, I'm just playing these two strings, the A string and the D string. Those are the only two that I'm strumming on this type of rhythm pattern. And you have your finger down, like this. So these are the three notes. You get this first one. Second one is a whole step up. Third one is a half step up. Back down a half step. Then back down a whole step and you strum both the strings together at the same time as you're playing it. So it's... Okay, so that's the, that's the basic foundation of it. One more time. to the D chord, which on the neck go up and it's one, two, three, four, five frets up, and the root note is on the A string, and you play this D bar chord, but you're only playing these two strings, the A and the D string on it, and you're doing the same thing, but then with your pinky, you stretch up a whole step and then a half step, so be like this. Same rhythm pattern, but you're just barring up here on the D. Then it goes back down to the A. Then down to the E. Then to the D. Then A. Then resolve. 
12 on the E. Then back to the A. Okay? So that's basically the rhythm to it and how you, how you do the fingering to it. It's basically what they call a 1-4-5 progression. And the reason it's called a 1-4-5 progression is because the 1 is the root note, which is A. The 4 is the 4th note in the A major scale, which is D. The 5 is the 5th note in the major scale, which is E, in the A major scale, and then back down to A. So it's a 1-4-5 blues progression, and that's how they get those terms, 1-4-5, it's all based on the major scale. Anyway, uh, one more time I'll show you the rhythm from back here, and uh, hopefully you'll remember the fingerings on how to do it. That's it, and I'll do another video too on some other types of blues rhythms, but that's like your basic blues rhythm. All right, take care. Thanks, bye.